don't, don't, don't call me Superman if you haven't found my kryptonite. What is going on, YouTube? It is the BK Cops 360 here, and of course, with Nvidia uh, releasing Titan X with a 999 US dollar price tag. Uh, there's a lot of eyes now back onto AMD. What are they gonna do? When is the 390X coming out? And of course, there's been a lot of shit since I last, you know, uploaded something. Uh, referring to, you know, the whole R9 300 series. I did a video back saying all of the leaked specifications. However, things seem to have changed a little bit since then. So firstly, let's get into it. Now, firstly, the 390X is supposedly going to cost over 700 US dollars. So it's actually supposed to be a pretty expensive card. And I believe there are two versions of the 390X. You've got the 390X, which is going to be air-cooled. And this is, of course, this is my speculation. But I believe that the air-cooled version will have 4 gigs of HBM RAM. And then you're going to have the 8 gigabyte. There's a water cool edition version. There's a water cool edition version of the 390X. I believe that's going to have 8 gigs of HBM RAM. Because if you look at some of the slides, some of the leaked slides that come out from AMD and some of their press conferences to the all in, uh, to the add in board partners, uh, it says specifically up to 8 gigabytes of HBM RAM. Now, when they say up to, of course, they could just be referring to the whole, um, uh, what's the. Uh, code name for the entire architecture. All right, not hundred percent sure. Fiji. They could just be talking about Fiji as a whole, and maybe the three ninety will have four gigs of HBM, and all both three ninety Xs will have eight gigs. But you know, who knows? We're just gonna have to see. But anyway, the three ninety X and the three ninety are you know they're gonna be based on Fiji. Apparently, the three ninety is supposed to be. Um, it's gonna be below seven hundred US dollars, I guess. But the big thing to say is that. The 380X is first. Of the 380X is supposed to perform better than the 290, and so is the 380. The, both the 380 and 380X are going to perform better than the 290, apparently. And according to this, the 380X will cost $400, and the R9 380 will cost $330. So I'm thinking there's going to be slight improvements over the 290X and the 290, and they're going to be scaled down a bit, like. You know, in the in the spectrum, in the in the tier. So you know, who really knows? But at the same time, if they both perform better, maybe there's something different. There's some rumors flying around that AMD isn't rebranding anything, and the entire lineup is new cards. So who fucking knows, man? There's so much speculation going on about this that we're just gonna have to wait and see, bro. So you know, we've got the 380 at 330 dollars, 380X at 400. Um, we've got the R9 370, which is supposed to cost 200 dollars. And it's supposed to compare between the 270X and the 285 in performance. So at $200, you're getting like a 7970 kind of performance, more like 7950. Well, a 7950, 7970 performance at $200. I've got a 7870 in here, man, or a 270X. This shit's getting outdated. I'm going to have to update this one day because if I really want to get serious about games and start, you know, cranking up my settings again, then I don't know. I'm going to need to make changes, but you know, who knows? It's kind of going to have to wait and see. And of course, you have the R9 360X, which is supposed to cost 150 US dollars, and it's going to perform like an R7 265, which is pretty much a Radeon 7850, I believe. So, yeah, you got that going on as well. I mean, fuck, it's just speculation at the moment. We're just going to have to wait and see. But, yeah, there's been a lot of talk going on. You know, 390X, it's, is it going to have 4 gigs or 8 gigs of HBM RAM? It's almost confirmed that it's definitely 8 gigs. But with the whole water cooled edition version and the normal v version and the 390, because the 390 is obviously just going to be a cut down 390X. Um, what's going to happen? We're just going to have to fucking wait and we're just going to have to see. So, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and comment down below what you actually think is going to happen because there's so much speculation there's not enough confirmation so for your meditation put down below what we're going to do or what AMD is going to do thank you guys for watching and I'll see you boys later